Hey, good afternoon, everybody. How are you? Everyone ready to get wet? I don't hear any like enthusiasm on this. <laughs> so anyhow, well, I'm delighted to be here. For those of you who don't know me, my name is Father Dan. I'm the chaplain here at the school. I wish. No, he wishes he were well, whatever. But I'm Father Jim. I'm happy to be here to kick off this Special Olympics. What's the name of this? Polar whatever? Polar pop. I'm hoping that I don't get too wet. I don't know if everyone is uh, prepared for that, but thank God the sun's out. And uh, this is a great event. I think Special Olympics is probably, when we think about all the things we do here at the university, um, this has to be one of the finest things that we do because it seems to me that we get so many students 
that are working so hard for such a great cause. So I want to thank our leadership team. If you're a leader of this special O, let's raise your hand. Okay, we want to thank all of them. And then also, as we begin this, as we do all things, let's take a moment to remember uh, so many people who are less fortunate than we are that don't have the opportunity to be on campus. Uh, for the many people who have died from coronavirus. And most importantly, let's remember all of the special people, uh, the women and men of intellectual disabilities of one sort or another, uh, who inspire us to be better people, and they're the people that we serve. So keeping them in mind, we say in the name of the Father, Son, Holy Spirit, amen. Gracious God, we gather here on this chilly, sunny afternoon uh, to be reminded of your love for the people uh, that you have created in your image and likeness the human family. As we celebrate Special Olympics, we remember especially those with intellectual disabilities who teach us to love life in a simple, concrete way. Help us always in their wonderful example uh, to be women and men who use our gifts and talents to the fullest. And we make these prayers through Christ our Lord. Amen. Father, Son, Holy Spirit, Amen. Okay, if it's, if it's possible for me not to get with, that would be fine too. Uh, so I don't know who I turned this microphone over to now. Here we go. line up and then we're gonna have six people line up behind them and each person there'll be one person in a parking spot. Okay, so it's gonna be six starting from right we'll the image, this parking spot, six over. Who would like to go first?